Welcome back. Let's summarize what we've learned about federal contract information, controlled unclassified information, and covered defense information. FCI is an umbrella which covers CUI and CDI. In a blog article, the National Archives Information Security Oversight Office stated that all CUI in possession of a government contractor is FCI, but not all FCI is CUI. We also learned that the protection requirements of FCI, CUI, and CDI are different. With that said, let's summarize each type of information. Federal contract information is created by or on behalf of the federal government and requires basic safeguarding. FCI is defined in the Federal Acquisition Regulations Clause 52.204-21. Examples of FCI include contract information, programmatic charts, and process documentation. Controlled unclassified information is created by or on behalf of the federal government and requires safeguarding. CUI is defined in 32 CFR Part 2002.4. An example from the National Archives CUI registry includes OPSEC information, physical security information, and system vulnerability information. Covered defense information is created by or on behalf of the DOD and requires safeguarding. CDI is defined in DFARS 252.204-7012. CDI is also referred to as DOD CUI. The DOD references the National Archives CUI registry, but also supplements it with its own CUI registry. The DOD CUI registry adds DOD-specific information to the CUI categories. In summary, FCI is defined in FAR 52.204-21. It applies to federal government contracts and requires basic safeguarding. CUI is defined in 32 CFR Part 2002.4. It applies to federal contracts and requires safeguarding. CDI is defined in DFARS 252.204-7012. It applies to DOD contracts and requires safeguarding. All right, that's all, folks. See you in the next one.